It's Michaela and Shayna online. And we are with one of the Candyland cast members, Bethany number one, Emma Sarai. Hi, Emma. Hello. It's great to see you again. You too. So, you're back in school, right? Yes, but I'm actually homeschooled. Oh, what's your favorite subject in homeschooling? Well, I'm very focused on geography. Geography? Is that so you like that? Yeah, I really want to know, you know, where everything is. <laughs> <laughs> what are you studying in geography right now? Well, I haven't really started yet, but I'm going to be studying different cultures. Like, first I'm going to start with Chinatown because it's very close to me. <laughs> <laughs> in L.A., yeah. <laughs> At first I thought you were talking about China. Mm, well, I will be studying China, too, after Chinatown. What recent um, acting jobs have you been in? Well, I have done a movie called Dependence Day, but it's a romantic comedy, so I can't, I can't really watch it because there are some gross parts in it, so <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be watching it, but it's going to be in theaters soon. Okay. Who do you play? Do you play, a little, like, anybody in the romance scene? Well, no, <laughs> but I, I play someone's daughter. Like, I play someone who chooses parts' daughter. Chooses Choose or something. Oh! If, could you give any advice to those young child actors out there just like yourself? Well, really study your craft and, I'm, I mean, you know, take acting classes. All right, good advice. Thank you. People need to take acting classes. Yeah. So tell us about a funny time in your life. Well, one time, my dad was setting me up for dinner. And, you know, I'm vegan, so my plate had, you know, rice and beans and broccoli and lettuce, you know, stuff like that that was very healthy. And then my dad says, are you ready? You know, are you secure? And I'm like, well, I would like some almond milk. So he gets me that, and he's like, you're good? And I'm like, yeah. So he sits down with his plate, and it has like five cookies on it, and a glass of lemonade like this tall. And I stop, well, I'm already eating, so I stop with my fork halfway to my mouth, and I'm like, I can't believe you have a cookie. I mean, seriously, I'm sitting here eating broccoli, and you have a cookie. That was, that was hilarious to my parents. <laughs> what makes you happy and what makes you sad? Well, something makes me happy is when I'm doing jobs and I'm on the set. I like that. And then something that makes me a little upset is that when I feel misunderstood, like someone thinks that I'm saying something I'm not. Like, am I speaking English? Do you not understand? So, like, I, I, I just feel confused. I'm sorry, I didn't understand that. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> what was your favorite part about working on Candyland? Well, I really loved it when I got to sneak into someone's house. That was fun. It was, like, uh, mischievous. I liked that part. Are you a mischievous person? Well, not really. I would never sneak into someone's house. I'm, I'm not that bold. <laughs> <laughs> if you could be president of the United States, what would you do for our country? Well, I would really stop all of the war and the bombing, yeah. and I would bring our troops home. And another thing is that people are against drugs and gangs and stuff like that. You know, so if people want to be a part of something, you should make community centers for them to be a part of. You would have so many artists if you teach people how to paint in the community centers and stuff like that, you know? Would you Rather make it than free? Gangs. Oh, yes. Where, huh? Would you make it free? Well, yes, I would because a lot of people need stuff that's free. If I gave you a magic wand and you could change anything in Kingland, what would it be? Well, I would make all of us have superpowers and oh weaknesses. I could shoot kale out of my hands. <laughs> <laughs> what would your superpower be? <laughs> well, my superpower would be really fast flight. Ooh. Ooh. So you can sneak into Beckham's house very fast. Yeah, that would be cool. If you could be any character character from TV or a movie, which character would you be? 
Well, I really like the little boy from Problem Child 2. I know it's a really old movie, but it's a really good movie. <laughs> What's okay. it about? Well, it's about a little boy who, uh, who is very mischievous, and then he makes another friend that is very mischievous. And, you know, they kind of bond together in the end. And do they become unmischievous or still mischievous? I think they're still kind of mischievous <laughs> in the end. <laughs> What's the grossest, nastiest thing you could think of? Well, off the top of my head, drinking after someone. Ew. <laughs> that would be kind of gross. Yeah. If yeah. they after, if they backwashed. Ugh. Like you're <laughs> drinking somebody's spit. <laughs> uh, what's your favorite thing to do with your parents? Well, I really like the show Big Bang Theory. Oh, you know, it's good. Way, it's great. <laughs> you're allowed to show. watch that. Well, yeah. <laughs> and where do you see yourself in 10 years? I see myself on the red carpet. <gasps> Standing next to all the celebs, and you're a celeb yourself, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> thank you for your interview. Yes, thank you so much, and we wish you successes to come. Yes. On the red carpet. Yes. <laughs> Bye. Bye.